Oh, and came on top. That's how he scored on me. Uh, he um, down, suck back. Me and Coach Ramos have been working on for two, three weeks now. Um, we thought we were going to get that match. Try not to look ahead, but we knew that I was really only he was going to beat me. I was getting those tilts because I knew I could build my pace on him. Um, he had a little bit of defense better. Couldn't really get too many attacks, but I just kept pushing my pace. Yeah. Last year your record uh, was around 500. Yeah. This year you're sitting in the NCAA semifinals. Yeah. I don't think it's a stretch to say you're one of the most improved wrestlers in the NCAA. You usually don't see that jump in a redshirt senior. What happened this offseason? I'm just going to be grateful um, for this experience right now. I don't know, really. Honestly, I think uh, just refocusing and realizing that I got one year left, what I really want to do. You know, So I really dedicated myself the whole summer, you know, working with the coaches, they always trusted in me. They did my hard work, so that's really it. I mean, I, I wish I could say I changed a whole bunch, but I really didn't. Just focus more. Did, was there a, a mental change, whether it was just confidence or something else or a mindset? Definitely confidence, you know. I went out to university. I felt, I felt like I was getting better at the end of last year, you know, and I didn't really know if I was or not, you know, went like one or two at the NCAAs. But then I went out to universities, beat some tough guys, and that was when I knew, like, hey, I gotta go all in this summer and I'm gonna do it next year. So it was definitely universities that gave me that confidence. Was there a sense of urgency? Like, man, I only got one more crack at this. I don't think so. I think I've always been a hard worker, you know, and um, I think really just refocusing and focus on areas I need to get better in rather than just going hard all the time, you know. Yeah. Just, just getting better at wrestling. And I think that's what made a difference this year. Training with a purpose? Yeah, exactly. How nerve wracking was to that just waiting to when they were reviewing the call? <laughs> um, I wanted to go my way, so you know, I'm like anxious, but like I said, I'm thinking worst case scenario, being ready to go out there and wrestle if I have to. How were you able to fight off that, that reverse? It looked like you almost had it there for a... I don't know. <laughs> just, just wrestled as hard as I could, you know. Yeah. Try to get my hips back up on top, but I mean, it really just comes down to you want to win, and I want to win. So. Well, congratulations. Good luck tonight. Thank you. What, what are your thoughts on facing Rutherford? Um, I'm excited, you know. The guy's got a target on his back for the past couple of years. Um, I believe I can win. I believe my, my coaches believe I can win. That's really all that matters. So I'm going out there to win tonight, and I'm, I'm excited for the opportunity.